In the third example, we'll change up our numbers a little bit. Our processor will use slightly less voltage, and the numbers for capacitive load in megahertz are not going to be quite the same anymore. So this time we have 3 volts of electricity, capacitive load of 2 microfarads, and a switching frequency of 5 megahertz. So when we put that, those into our equation, we get 2 microfarads times 3 volts squared times 5 megahertz. Again, convert the microfarads and megahertz into farads and hertz. Get 2 times into the minus 6th farads times 9 volts squared times 5 times 10 to the 6th hertz. As before, our 10 to the minus 6th will cancel with our 10 to the 6th, and we will get 2 times 9 is 18 times 5 equals 90 watts of power.